Welcome everyone. Thanks for tuning in to 2K Sports for this NBA presentation. With two Hall of Famers, Doris Burke and Grant Hill, I'm Brian Anderson, Ali LaForce, our reporter. We've got the Detroit Pistons and the Chicago Bulls. Takes one from 10 feet. Oh, sweet move. Pass to Jordan. Rose with the bucket. Derrick Rose is feared as a driver of the basketball, but boy, that three-point shot has come a long way. Detroit keeps possession. To the inside. Not the tallest center in the league. He more than makes up for it with those crazy hops. Pass to Jordan. Puts up a three. And again, it's Chicago with a three. The vision by Rose, right? Hits the open man. He's creating for others. And this guy is so tough to deal with. That pass had to be thrown not only in the right spot, but at the right time. Pippen, no good. Here's Dumars. Counted from Joe distance. Dumas. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. Here's Gilmore. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Gilmore. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. And I think defensively, that is not the way you ben want to Wall. start giving up high percentage looks. That doesn't typically end well. That's how you share the rock. He does this time and time again. That one's good for two. When you're trying to stop a guy like this, you have to match his intensity level. Hill for three. The Pistons rebound. Pass to Dumars. And Detroit again with the bucket. And the lead just keeps changing hands. Five times already, and we still haven't gotten out of the first half. From deep, Rose. The offensive rebound. Clock at six. To the wing on the left. Pass to Pippen. Three-pointer. Lanier with the rebound. The Pistons leading. Now Hill. Here's Thomas. Oh my goodness! He'll go to the line with a chance at a four-point play. Here are the Bulls with the ball. Rose outside. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. He's got six. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly that was their game plan coming in. in the first. Here's Lanier. Two minutes. And he'll draw the foul. First person to foul. That free throw misses. Second team foul. At the line for the Pistons. And he's good on the second. 157 left in the opening quarter. Pass to Sloan. Here's Gilmore. The second effort. Wallace pulls it in. Well, this is the kind of shot we've come to expect him to make. He's got to be upset with that one. Nice one-handed jam. Simple and effective. Hey, hey, with the lead, I'm surprised he didn't come up with something a little more creative. Here's Armstrong. One twenty-one left in the first quarter. And he gets it to go. Four for six so far. Well, just tremendous composure on the interior. Read the defense, take advantage of the situation, and deliver. Here's Thomas. Oh, there's the alley! And a fast break now for the Bulls. Butler, the open look. And he stays with it. To the middle. And there's the slam! Dunk to finish it off. Just really smart distribution from Jimmy Butler right there. He's putting a bigger emphasis on getting his teammates involved. The three ball. 
Another three for Detroit. This guy a tough cover for any defender. Creative and assertive scoring the ball. Here's Gilmore. Right side love. Outside for Butler. From deep. The long distance three is buried. Jimmy well playing a little long ball. Butler shows you you have to respect him even if he enters the parking lot. Isaiah Thomas, that's good. Both teams are starting to find a rhythm here. And this is partly what the game has become, right? A matter of dueling three-point opportunities. It's good! It's good at the buzzer! Wow! They credit him for understanding the situation and coming. And this has been a fairly close game through the first quarter. We'll see what happens here in the second. And a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the Pistons. Well, they found a group that is from Chicago trailing here. Jordan up top. Here's Gilmore. In low. And too long on the shot. Here's Billups. To the paint. Here's Lambeer. And count the basket. Bulls making a switch here. The Bulls on offense. Six point game. Pass to Rose. Here's Pippen. Releases. Down low. Ooh, they pick off the pass. Pass to Rodman. Here's the busher. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Now here's Rose. Here's Noah. Off target from outside. Boy, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Stackhouse. Jerry Stackhouse. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. From deep, Rose. He's looking good. Two buckets and three attempts. Rose. That's simply about feel, right? Derrick Rose in pick and roll situations has such a good feel for the right decision. Pass to Rodman. Chicago grabs the miss. Now Rose. He's got six. Here's Noah. And he slams it in one-handed. Give me attitude any day of the week. Joe Kim Noah trying to fire up his teammates. Dennis Rodman. Oh, not the defensive effort they need to cut into the lead. Boy, good call. You have to at least try to protect the rim. They're just too slow to react. You can't afford to sleepwalk through possessions. What's going on out there? Here's Rose. Here's Rodman. And he dunks it down. Rodman. And you can see the advantage of running the offense through Derrick Rose, showing strong decision-making, really nice pass. Pass to Lambeer. Inside. And the basket Jordan by Stackhouse. Stackhouse. And assist. Detroit leads by five. Bill Lambeer. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point blank range. From deep, Rose. Rodman with a rebound. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the second quarter. Nifty move. That shot missing. Now Chicago takes it the other way. Pass to Jordan. Rose outside. Down to five on the shot clock. He takes it in. 
Drains it. Whoa. Now he's three for five. Yeah, he's still showing flashes of that incredible athleticism. Rose is a force attacking the lane. Pass to Stackhouse. The three is up. Another three Jerry for Stackhouse. Detroit. This three-point three. shot looks so pure. The defense allows dance team. And Chicago has possession. Nice. One more they trail by six. For your balls, kid. Oh, they get a hand on it. Rose outside. Distance foul. First team. And out of bounds. Detroit will have it. 44 seconds left to play in the second quarter. Poke loose. And up the court come the Bulls on the break. Well, that's quick hands and a quick mind by Jimmy Butler. Creates the turnover, gets right out in transition. Hey, who's watching you? Here's Thomas. Seven points in the game. Hill can't connect. Well, put all that size to good use. Rip it off the backboard. Two seconds separating the shot clock and the game clock. From deep, Rose. Love. Oh, here's Love with the jam. And Rose, always aggressive coming off those screens, forced the defense to contain him and drops it off for the nice assist. Out of bounds. And the ball out of play. The Bulls will have it. Just four seconds left in the second. And the first half comes to a conclusion in a game that's been very close so far. The Pistons on top. They're up by two. Evenly contested game. To the middle. Ooh, it's stolen away. Pass to Rodman. This for the tie. Here's Gilmore. up as that one misses and here is Hill down low and it's stolen by Rhodes and up the court come the Bulls on the break pass to Jordan and now the Pistons in transition here's Dumars uses the glass to finish the layup he's got 10 Transition basketball, the most reliable way to generate easy looks. The very definition of quality transition offense. If it can end at the cup, it's exactly where you want it. Back to Rose. Here's Rodman. Pass to Jordan. It's only a matter of time before they finally get the buck for basketball played here in the third quarter. Here's Wallace. Oh, a nice one-handed slam right there. And plays like that one can make the difference in a close game. And it definitely got the bench on their feet, too. Well, credit him for going for it. Nice. Michael, Michael, Fires from deep. It's rebounded by Lambeer. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Chicago trailing here. Here's Pippen. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Up top, Levine. Shot clock at six. Here's Jordan. And there's the shot clock violation. Tony Kuko. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Knocks down the long J. And Detroit leads by seven. Even though he hasn't lit up the scoreboard, I like how he's keeping others involved. Here's Rodman. Pass to Kukoc. On the wing, Levine. Here's Kukoc. Five to shoot. The Bulls need to get off a shot. 
The three is up. Detroit with a rebound. I think they could have gotten a better look right there. And he just a little over anxious, I think, to get that shot off. Well, he's a quality mid-range shooter, but he can't get that one to go. Here's Noah. Nice touch on the bank shot. A little under three and a half minutes off the clock now in the third quarter. Hey, yo, look right here. Pass to Stackhouse. And they're running. Here's Noah. Back to Levine. Five on the clock. With so little time on the clock, that'll be a five-second call. That's an inbound violation. A minute nine left in the third. Here's Stackhouse. Drops in the three. Ten points for him. Jerry this is what he gives you night in and Three. night out. Stellar production at the offensive end. Pass to Butler. To the inside. Cuts off the pass. Thirty-four seconds left to play in the third quarter. Here's Lambeer. Off target. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. And so here is Chicago. Eight-point game. Pass to Love. Here's Rodman. And he was camped in the lane there. Substitution for the Bulls. Artist Gilmore. Here's Hamilton. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Richard Hamilton. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible the for the defense to account for everyone. The Bulls. And here at the end of the third, it's a double-digit ball the game. Pistons. Pistons. Rose with it. Launches a three. The Pistons clear it. Here's Stackhouse. Nice move. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. And Detroit leads by 13. Outside Butler. Back to Rose. Knocked loose. Here's Hamilton. Pass to Rodman. Just four to shoot. The Pistons need to get one up quick. Here's Stackhouse. Goes back up. And he's going to make him earn it at the line. Shooting for Detroit. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Detroit. What stood out to me was their passing. They moved the ball effortlessly and have been able to find those holes in the defense. Pass to Rodman. A few possessions into the fourth. Just over a minute play. Out left to the wing. Here's Diaz. And Hamilton pulls it down. Boy, we're seeing inspired play out of them. And that's certainly reflected in the score. And he can't get the first one. Two shots. And no luck at the stripe this time. Second one won't fall. Final quarter here, and we're just over a minute and a half through it. Now here's Rose. Pass to Theus. Six to shoot. That one falls. Nice feed that time for Rose. Well, that's a case where your teammates are showing trust in you, and he comes through with flying colors. Rodman. Dennis Rodman. Takes the assist and lays it in. Nice. And catch up with Ali LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Chicago's coach was going over with his team. 
He stressed the need to protect the ball. He said, quote, turnovers are killing us. We can't keep giving away possessions. It's a great way to agitate a coach. Let's send it back to the broadcast table now. Thank you for that, Allie. Take it away! Back to Hill. He tries for three. Fires in the triple. Three and it's just totally relentless, only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. The Pistons clear it. You know, so much of rebounding is about effort, and no lack of that right there. He had to box right out here. and establish great position. Assist goes and he couldn't get an easier shot. The defense right now just looks defeated. Well, simply stated, simply not enough effort. Not enough attention to detail. They've gotten run Two over this season. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. We've got 1.55 left in the fourth quarter. Here's Jordan. That shot off. And Detroit will go the other way with it. And it's out of bounds. Out of bounds. Last. 144 left in the game. Pass to Billups. Knocks it down from distance. Chauncey Billups. Have to show more effort defensively. Everyone knows he can do that from deep. Well, to me, that's just inexcusable. You start to wonder how much they really want this basketball game. Hill for three. Can't get it to drop. Detroit Falls. Substitution for the Bulls. 119 left Joe in the fourth Kim quarter. Bob Pass Lowe. to Noah. Zach Levine. Here's Kukoc. Checked by Hill. Armstrong. Shot clock at five. Here's Armstrong. The steal. Here's Billups. And so he draws the foul. Personal foul. And he knocks down the first one. At the line for the Pistons. He's perfect from the line this time. 51 seconds left in the fourth quarter. To stop the drought. Oh, and the jam by Levine. Such a big-time athlete, Levine makes the hardest moves look easy. Pass to Stackhouse. Here's Rodman, covered by Love. Here's Billups. Six on the shot clock. To the paint. It's stolen by Love. Inside. Here's Levine. And Levine throws it down. No surprise, Zach Levine goes for the slam, opens a window at the cup, and he takes advantage. Pass to Kukoc, to the middle. Here's Noah. The fadeaway. Can't connect. And so it's Detroit easily grabbing this one. End of the game. A statement road victory. So impressive. Statement in DBA. It was an enemy territory, but they controlled the game and took the crowd completely out of it. That's how you win on the road. And that'll.